And so the thing is, is that when you think about your antenna system, it's a chain of things coming out of the back of your radio that includes chokes, right. balance, tuners, coax, sometimes a secondary piece of coax, your janky pole that your antenna is mounted on, everything connected to your antenna and stuff that's near your antenna. And I just don't get it, right? Like, I, I don't understand how people can be so concerned about the quarter of a dB savings they get using the expensive European coaxial cable, but then use a carbon mass fiber, right? Like, doesn't one negate the other? So it's like, well, why can't I save a couple hundred bucks with RG8 and, and, a, and, a, and a fiberglass pole and get the same performance? Uh, did we? I'm, I'm done. Okay. <laughs> I don't disagree with him on that. I 100% agreement. I, I'll buy coax from ABR. Uh, gray man out there said he only uses the finest Amazon coax. Right. There's differences. I'm sure that Italian coax is right. But blessed by the Pope, you got to get the pontiff has there. has poured holy water on it and vine vine vice. But I mean, I, I don't know that there's enough difference to care. And that leads me to my next point, which was 45's question. 45, I don't think there's enough difference to care. In my scenario that I've used here, <laughs> empirical data says there ain't enough difference to care. I literally don't see where I would give not one turd about the difference.